Hi everyone, I'm Randall Rufino, founder and CEO of HKT Fragrances. I also have a day job, director for business development and marketing. Life before aid was quite a challenge. I was not able to go to mostly of the schedules of my doctors because of the day job that I have, the business that I'm running, and of course the schedule and traffic. Aid solved the convenience. It started when there was pain in my, my shoulders and I, I knew I had to get therapy. But before getting the therapy, I knew I had to be assessed first by the doctor. And just that schedule alone to have me assessed was already a challenge because we couldn't get our schedule to match. Yeah, Because of aid, that night they went to my house while I was watching. Netflix. There was a friend of mine, same village, okay, that posted about it. I choose listening to friends' recommendations more than the sponsored ads that you have there. And he gave a very good review. So I said, why not try it? Thankfully, it was very successful with me and very convenient that I even posted about it. Every time a friend tells me that they have something hurting or even their pets, I automatically recommend aid. I don't know if there are other options because I don't look anymore because I'm very satisfied with aid. It's all about convenience because day, time, and place, you're the one that's being followed. It's very private because I have it in my own home. So I know we're handled by professional doctors and therapists because even before they're sent to you, you're given a list of uh, therapists and doctors that you could choose from. Now, every time there's pain, I book an aid. To relax myself, I book a massage. But of course, to heal me, to have me recover, I use aid. Me and my friends are going to do the Berlin Marathon this September. I plan to book therapists with aid that instead of them doing a rehab with me, it's a prehab. So they can prepare me that I don't get injuries. Quite a funny story is uh, when the doctor came in only to find out is my co-parent teacher in uh, Isabel. And I looked up to the doctor and that doctor is an aid. So you know, put two and two together, that was a good story. The biggest change now is I don't skip any therapy because I'm worry-free already because I can always just book aid. It's just like you know, those other apps that you get for transportation, for food, or etc. But this one is for health. So which makes it very, very good. I love it. Hi, I'm Phil Kenglet Cayetano. I'm a professional volleyball player and I have three beautiful kids. That's why it's hashtag Mamathlete. I think for us, working moms actually, stress yung sino mag-aalaga ng kids mo and kung kampante ka ba sa mga pag mo ng mga kids mo. With Aid app, they're anytime, anywhere. Go to their app, they could provide agad someone to help me and like I could leave my kids na kampante yung feeling ko na they're well taken care of. Actually, I found out about Aid app through Instagram lang. Like people posting on their stories and then I message them on Instagram. I've been using Aid app for one year na and so far so good. Everything's been well. Like I know na trusted sila and they also send me the background of the nurse or the caregiver, how old, yung mga ganon. They give you enough knowledge and transparency to know who's coming into your home, who are you welcoming. Kasi nga syempre, welcoming someone in your home, they want to take care of your kids. Life right now with Aid app. Mas maginhawa kasi nga alam ko na there's always someone I can go to kung may emergency sa ko. If I need to go to training, like biglaan, I need to go out of the country or out of town. Alam ko na may masasandalan akong ila. I'm Angeline Mary Miraflor. I'm a mom of three and an HR professional. My husband is afraid of doctors. It would take us months before I'd have him see a doctor. My dad would dribble appointments to have his blood work done, all those things. I'm following this celebrity named Bianca Gonzalez. Two weeks prior to my first encounter with Ed, he had her lab tests done at home. And I'm like, pwede yon? And I got curious, I downloaded the app. So I had three different services done already. So we've done the vaccine, we've done the doctor consultation, and we've done the laboratory. And so that's been a year already. And my husband is asking me and encouraging, encouraging me now to book our next vaccination. He's actually inquiring about the measles vaccine for also the yayas at home. It's different because they've experienced the availability. My dad is asking me when his next blood work's gonna happen and I'm like, yeah, they're gonna go to your house maybe in April. And it's like, okay, tell me lang. So my kids are more comfortable having them at home. So I don't think I'll have it any other way moving forward. 
It's a game changer, especially for those who can't go to hospitals. It's not just the convenience, affordability, but also the kind of people who work in aid. In all my encounters, they were very nice. That's why I think aid will be part of our lives as long as it's there. <laughs>